Hi, this is Corey from CK Devices, and today I wanted to give you a demo and show you some of the features of Mongoose. Mongoose is a 9 degree of freedom inertial measurement unit, and it's based around an Atmega 328 uh, microcontroller running the Arduino bootloader and a handful of sensors. So we have a triple axis accelerometer, a triple axis gyroscope, a triple axis magnetometer, and down on the bottom here there is a barometric pressure sensor that also has a built-in temperature sensor. So together these sensors give Mongoose the ability to um, determine its attitude, its, its heading, as well as its altitude. So this has applications for um, uh, autopilots or camera stabilization in an aircraft maybe or any kind of other any other kind of handheld device that needs to know its position and which way it's pointing. So the microcontroller collects the data from from all of these sensors that are all on an I2C bus and it processes it uh, to to give you um, this this heading and, and attitude information and it outputs it over uh, some serial pins so you can plug this into your microcontroller or into your PC and your your microcontroller or PC can use this data to to for example run your autopilot or or stabilize your camera so I can give you a demo how this works here so I have just a, a USB to serial converter and we'll go ahead and plug this in here On the computer, I'm running some, some demo software that lets us look at all the sensor data as well as um, give us a bit of visualization. There's an artificial horizon and a compass. So I'm going to go ahead here and select the COM port and the, the baud rate. And I'll click open port. And here you go. You can see uh, we have some indication of raw sensor data so you can see as I'm tilting the sensor around as I'm tilting the mongoose around you can see the sensor data changing and you can see the the artificial horizon and showing the, the uh, pitch and roll and, and we got the yaw um, there with the compass so this is just a, a good piece of software for helping you set up your sensors and give you an indication of, of whether or not things are working um, and we also have the source code for this, so this could be the basis for, for maybe um, you could add some additional features to this and you could use this as a base. So I'm just going to show you a few of the other, other features that we've uh, built into Mongoose that make it um, uh, a little bit more usable. The first is we've taken the additional uh, I.O. pins on the microcontroller and we've brought them out to this user um, I.O. header. So there's there's nine extra I.O. pins that we've brought out and um, all of these pins have uh, alternate functions. So there's ADC pins, PWM pins, um, an external interrupt. So you could use these for example connecting uh, buttons and LEDs or maybe uh, uh, you, could, you could also connect a GPS receiver or additional sensors. Um, so if you have an application that maybe needs uh, just a couple other parts or sensors, um, doesn't really warrant having a complete separate microcontroller, you could just add those to the user I.O. Um, on this header here. Also another nice feature is we've brought out the I2C bus to a header. So the four sensors are all on the same I2C bus, so really useful for debugging having this, uh, this uh, I2C header here. Also it lets you add additional I2C sensors. Say you have a, um, a humidity sensor or maybe a memory chip or something like that that's I2C. You could plug it in there and uh, no hacking required. Also another uh, little feature that makes it use more usable is we've we've made sure that when we design this that all of the um, through hole headers and the four mounting holes are all on a 0.1 inch grid. So that means you could mount this directly to a piece of um, prototype board or a proto shield on your Arduino, for example, and uh, all the all the holes uh, will perfectly line up with just a standard 0.1 inch grid. So in the next uh, few days and over the next week, we're going to be releasing some 
some example code uh, to show you how you could do a few things with the mongoose. Um, in the works we have some firmware to do camera stabilization. So basically we'll be hooking up a couple servos to the user I.O. pins and we'll be using mongoose to uh, stabilize the camera. So this would, for example, um, could be used if you had a camera on the bottom of your, your RC plane or your UAV and you always want it to point down uh, regardless of whether or not the plane is banking. You, we'll show you how you could use a mongoose to keep your camera pointed down by controlling some servos. Also in the works we have um, uh, some firmware that uh, shows you how you can connect a GPS receiver up to some of those user I.O. pins and use the processor here to read in the GPS data and just add it to the sensor data that's already being sent out the serial port to your external micro. So you could use this for collecting all of your your you know your your attitude and your heading data as well as your altitude and your position data from the from the GPS. So that's a, just a quick overview of of some of the features and uh, what we have um, coming for Mongoose. So um, make sure you check back on the website and we'll be updating those over the next few days and the coming weeks.